Hi, welcome to Julia's Broderie. Today I'm going to show you how to do fishbone stitch, which is great for filling in leaves. You're going to bring your needle up at the top center of your leaf pattern, and you're going to make a tiny little stitch at the top, just in the center. So one stitch like that. Then you're going to go to the side of that stitch along the edge of the outline, and you're going to bring your needle down just in front of that middle stitch. And then you're going to go to the other side. So each time you're going to alternate sides and you're going to bring it down just in front of that one again, and then come back to this side. And basically you just keep alternating and doing this all the way down until you filled your leaf shape and it gives you a sort of center stem. And then obviously the leaf is filled with the little lines. It's really quite a fun, satisfying stitch. So just keep coming to the center, alternating sides as you go. I'll do a few more and then I'll show you what it's looking like. And you can do them as tight or as loose as you like, depending on, on your pattern. For those of you doing the Blooming Bouquet kit, that one has this fishbone stitch on the leaves and those flowers some of the flowers see how it's filling the whole leaf and that's basically a fishbone stitch so just keep going until you get to the very bottom and that's the leaf finished you can see it's all filled in and if when you get to the end you find that there's some spaces in between that you feel like you didn't fill it quite enough you can just add in a couple of stitches to fill those gaps if they weren't tight enough 